everybody. So I'm back again with my um, weekly update. So I'm going to talk about the books that I'm currently reading and I'm also going to talk about a couple of the books that I got in the mail. Um, and I also got a uh, another item for my library so I'll talk about that in the video too. I'll probably show you that at the end of the video just because like it's just a random. <laughs> it's random. Okay so um, I'll start off with the books that I'm currently reading and then I'll move into the stuff that I got. So uh, I haven't really it's okay if you watched my last update then it's going to be very similar to that one. Um, so the physical book that I'm currently reading is actually um, Skype. And that's by Neil Shusterman, and I did not get very far in it. I'm still pretty much in the same spot I was in last time. Um, I am really enjoying it. I just haven't been spending a lot of time on it because I've been reading other books instead. Um, so no, this one I haven't gotten any further in. Really, I got maybe a chapter further, but I'm still really enjoying it. I'm really loving the book. Um, I just, I'm not much further. Currently, I would rate it five stars, though. So it, where I'm at right now, I would say five stars, definitely. Um, so then another book that I'm currently reading is Sea Witch Rising. That is the one that I'm listening to on audiobook. And I'm about the same spot I was in last time. I don't remember how far I said I was last time. I think I said it was like 30 minutes into the audiobook. Um, I might be like an hour in now. <laughs> so not a whole lot further. Uh, I haven't made a lot of progress on that one. I still am really liking that one as well. Um, I'd probably rate that one um, maybe... Yeah, probably five stars for that one as well where, with where I'm at right now. Um, of course, that can always change. You never know like what your opinions are going to be about a book until you've actually totally finished the book. And then sometimes even then that will change over time. But um, for right now, both of the books I'm currently reading are five stars. The ebook I was reading last time, Spin the Dawn, um, that one I actually finished. So... There's one change, at least, from last time, and um, I really loved the book. I'm going to actually do a complete uh, video about my review for the book, so stay tuned for that. Uh, keep an eye out, and you'll be able to watch that if that's something you're interested in hearing or seeing. Um, so then that's pretty much it for the books I'm currently reading, other than a couple of books I'm reading for the next video I'm doing, but I'm going to talk about that in the next video because it doesn't make sense to talk about it twice. Um, so for the books that I'm that I recently got, um, I'll start off with like these ones here. So it's actually two packages, um, but that's just because they're both from my friend Savannah. Um, I met her at Book Expo this year. Actually, um, I Annie actually introduced us. Annie Sullivan. Um, she's the author of Touch of Gold and Tiger Queen, which is coming out soon. So I'm friends with her and so she introduced us and so it's really awesome the connections you get to make when you go to these sorts of things um you just meet some really wonderful people and they're both just really awesome so anyways um these are from savannah they're actually her book so she sent me a copy of i'm okay i'm terrible at pronouncing things so i might butcher this but it is the guaifenian i'm pretty sure and it is, um, she sent me two copies because one of them is for me. She signed a copy for me. And the other one is for me to paint and send back to her. Um, so I don't know which one's which, but they are slightly different. They look the same from the front, but from the back, they are not the same book. They have slightly different descriptions. Um, other than that, they're the same, I think. I guess I can't say for sure that they're the same. Oh, the pages are different. Oh, maybe they're not. They look different to me. Maybe they don't look different to you, but they look like they're slightly different paper, maybe. I don't know. It doesn't matter. Either way, they're the same content. So these are about a girl who gets a magic necklace featured on the cover. And so it's like a fantasy novel with dragons somehow. I'm not sure how the dragons are going to come in. I haven't gotten a chance to read it yet. Like I said, I just got these in the mail. Um, she mailed them both. The reason why they were in two packages was because she mailed one and then she mailed the other one after. So they just came in two separate packages. Um, and so the magic necklace apparently gives her the power to disappear. So I'm very excited to get to read this one and I'm really excited to get to paint it. Um, there's a couple of colors that I think would look really awesome, but I, she did, she wants her copy to be purple to match the necklace. 
So I'm definitely excited to do that. And then I'll get to see how purple looks to see if I want my copy to be purple or I was thinking maybe like yellow would look cool for my copy. So clearly like you can see the dragon reference right here and the necklace reference. And I'm really excited to get to read this. Um, yeah, so that's exciting. Oh, and she actually, the sequel's coming out soon too. Um, I just got on her street team for that, for the sequel. And that one I believe is coming out in November, if I'm not mistaken. I'll, I'll talk to you guys about that, I'm sure, when it's closer to that coming out because I like to talk about new releases as they come out. Anyways, so then this is another package I got um, from another friend, actually, kind of, in a roundabout way, though. Um, this is from my friend Stephanie. She is the author outreach um, admin for Words and Whimsy Book Club, um, which is through Facebook. I mentioned before that I'm an admin of that group. Um, well, she is as well, and she... Um, I think you might have just seen a peek of the cover, so I'm not very good at being secretive. Um, so she contacted, uh, she contacts our authors and publishers, so that way we can have the authors that come and chat with us every month. Um, so she contacts them and they'll send us copies of books if we're considering having them um, come to the group or if we're just considering having them for like maybe a club read for the group or if we've already booked them for the group So basically if there's anything group related that we're considering the author for then we might end up with a copy of their book So I ended up with two copies of well met which is by Jen DeLuca and um, The two copies is because one of the copies is for me and the other copy is for a giveaway in that book group so um, we, I don't believe we've announced it in that group yet. So hopefully we announce today because I'm planning on uploading the video, t this video today. So either you guys will know first or maybe we'll announce it in there. But um, yeah, these are finished copies of the book. Actually, they're not the, they're not ARCs. The book is not out yet though. The book comes out on, um, I believe it is September 3rd. It's the first Tuesday in September. Um, if I'm not mistaken, it's the third. And they're about a Renaissance Bear. So it's a contemporary romance YA book um, about a renaissance fair and I'm super excited. It looks really cute. I love that cover. Um, and yeah, like I, I think I mentioned in my book haul that I'm really feeling contemporary right now. I'm shifting a little bit into fantasy. So this is kind of a nice blend of the two because renaissance kind of gives you some fantasy vibes while also still being like placed in the modern time period with modern like things. So it's kind of like having your cake and eating it too, in a way. Um, so that's the books that I got. Like I did not a big haul right now, but I've got a really big haul coming up because, um, book outlet did another sale. So of course, you know, I decided to buy myself a bunch of books. Um, uh, I called it my birthday book haul. <laughs> so there's going to be a birthday book haul coming up soon. Cause my birthday is coming up. It's the 31st. So um, I'll have a video coming up for that. I don't know if I'm going to be getting any like books as presents other than the ones that like Stephanie's requesting for me for from publishers and authors. Um, but I did buy myself some. So at the very least, there will be the books that I bought for myself coming up. And then I actually also have a gift card to a bookstore. So I might buy some books from them too after my birthday. I'm not 100% sure if I will do that because um, you can't tell from like where I'm sitting here, but I have got like stacks of books on some of my shelves that just don't have spots because <laughs> there's no space for them. So I need to do like an unhaul soon too. <laughs> so that's probably going to be coming up at some point. Um, yeah. So then the only other thing that I really have for you is the weird random thing I bought for the um, library. And that's actually a, I bought a rug for it. It's just like a little circular rug. I'll put a little video clip or photo clip of it in here. So that way you can see what my rug looks like in case that's something you're interested in seeing. Um, but like I said, it's, it's not like an exciting thing that I got. So um, I also got my Owl Crate box this week, but I'm not going to show you what the book is right now because I just did a uh, video where I did the whole box on haul. So if that's something you're interested in checking out, definitely check out my last video. I believe it was the one that I just uploaded, but either way it's labeled. So you can check that out if that's something you're interested in. And I'm really excited about the book I got in that. Um, I mentioned in the video how excited I was for that book and how I wanted it. Um, but I did actually find out 
after the fact um, that I do own that book. I mentioned in the video I wasn't sure if I did, and I don't own a physical copy, so now I do, um, but I did own a digital copy. I had requested the ARC on NetGalley, and I was going through my NetGalley ARCs, and I saw it on there, and I was like, oh, you do own it. <laughs> so either way, I'm really excited about getting like an actual copy of the book, and it's beautiful, so I'm really excited for that. All right, so um, that is my update for this week, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!